good with y'all? It's your boy Cam bringing in the video straight like that. Comment down below what you want to see in the next one. Get to get like a thousand million likes on this video and make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell twice so that you can see all my videos and stuff. Uh, but today I'm going to be reacting to a couple of different videos and the reason why is because um, I want to show y'all how self-improvement does not get you girls, bro. Uh, it doesn't really matter how much you level up. It's, 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 it's complete cope, as they say, right? Cope, is that what they call it? It's cope. It's a coping mechanism because, let's be honest here, dog. Self-improvement works to some degree, to some extent. But there's levels to this stuff, dog. And it's time to be real, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, I used to believe that any dude who was of any looks could pull a girl, could could do that. But, but that's just not the case as we start to get further and further into the future as we start to get older. That's just not the case because, listen, there's clearly some people that it don't matter how much they self-improve, they just not ever going to get, they never going to get there, bro. I'm sorry. There's levels to this type of stuff, right? And so I'm not saying that it's completely cooked for y'all if you are below a certain level. Like, I'm not on that type of timing. But what I am saying is that you do have a ceiling. You have a genetic ceiling. Like, for example, right? And height is not everything, but I'm going to show y'all a perfect example. A six foot five dude, well, you know, very tall, who has acne and is super lanky and skinny looking. We got a got a whole, you know, skinny, uh, uh skinny fat build, right? He, if he self improves and starts to get some muscles, he clears up his skin. He gonna get a plethora of women, but let a five seven guy be in that same position. Acne, super duper lanky. He get a little bulky. He clean up his skin. He might get a few more women, a little bit more attention. But let's be honest. He's not going to get girls coming up to him. He's not going to have an easier, he's not, he'll have a slightly easier time with girls, but it won't be too much because at the end of the day, it's kind of like you, you just have to play with the cards that you was dealt, bro. You have to play with your current hand and there's nothing that you could do about it, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like we all just pressing random in the 2K, my creator, my, my career screen, bro. We all, we press random at birth and we just got to rock with what we got, bro. You know what I'm saying? So it's it like it's just like your meat. You can look. Everyone want to have a big mandingo, but like we can't all do that. We can't always have, you know. what I'm saying some of us just just got little Peters, you know. But anyway, I'm gonna show y'all the difference between what happens when you have looks and are already attractive versus somebody that needs self improvement in order to potentially, hopefully, get girls. I'm 19. Where are you from, though? I'm from Texas. Make him like, you in Texas? Let me find out. Now, off rip, bro. That's what I'm talking about! That's why he's doing anything! You say your name, Nina? Look, bro. And no diddy at all, bro. No diddy at all. This is a gender... This is an attractive-looking dude. Attractive dude. He got the dreads. He got the whatever. You know what I'm saying? The, the beard going, the little chin strap. You know what I'm saying? Tattoos. Generally attractive looking dude. Look at the way she look at him immediately. You know what I'm saying? Basically. Look at look at look at her eyes, bro. That's you can see the eyes is a window to the soul. You can see that she ready to go. She ready to make it splash. You know what I'm saying? You Mexican? I'm Honduran. Damn, what's wrong with Honduras? I know about Hondurans. I had an experience with one. That toxic. You toxic? Nah. Crazy? Nah. You gonna be counting the tires on my car? And Nah. Why the fuck you lying? Don't lie to me, Nina. <laughs> <laughs> See how she laughing? See how she nervous, bro? This is this is the reality for attractive men. I'ma be honest. You can't even really see his build. It doesn't matter what his build look like. He didn't need to be in the gym. Y'all can hate me, but let's be honest. You can't even see his build. He could be the lankiest, have a a, a gut. Don't matter. It don't matter. All she sees is this man's face. <laughs> Genetics. Sign Instagram? Yeah, Joe. You want me to type it or you want me to say it? I like your voice. I want you to tell me that shit. Man, stop playing with me. What? I'm the first to, get to, to do all type of shit. Oh, you guys, her name is my favorite movie. Yeah, that's my favorite movie, too. How old are you? 20. How old are you? Me, too. The world is yours, right? Tell me you trying to spoil me or something? Let him cut. I ain't no trick, nah. Yeah, we could really spoil each other. Just give me my money. Spoil each other, yeah. Perfect. So, just me just spoiling you? No. Are we going to spoil each other, mama? You fucking with the bulls. I ain't just a, a man. Ah. What's Instagram? You got any? Asked him to Instagram first. 
You see what I'm talking about? Ask them to Instagram first. My dog is just... Yes, sir. Now, obviously, he's cutting out... He's probably cutting out the rejections or whatever. We just assume it. But the point is not that he's cutting out the rejections. Because everybody's going to get rejected sometime. That's not the point. The point is that look at how easy of a time he's having. He's not having to do too much. He don't have to rhythm for so long and do this and come pick up line. He's literally just chilling. They even asking him for the gram first. Look, I look. I appreciate you, mom. Better stop. Man. <laughs> she didn't got serious. How old are you? I'm 18. How old are you? 22. Where you from? Connecticut. Wait, what's your Zodiac? I'm a Gemini. I'm crazy as fuck, though. Like, I'm Puerto Rican. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Crazy. I'm a Libra. We compatible. We are. Yeah, you want so me, son. <laughs> Man, and I'm also compatible. This man know about the zodiac signs. Oh, shit, lies. Asking him for the gram. Yo, fucking Instagram. I need that number. Like, two or three. Jimmy. Listen. Bro. Y'all can say Cam is black. I'm really not black, dude, because I do believe that there is a level where you can increase your looks, right? You can definitely increase your looks a little bit. I'm not saying that you just doomed from birth. You know what I'm saying? I, but 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 there is a cap. There is a cap. Go and be honest. Like, it's like, it's almost like, and I've explained this before in an old, old video. I don't even remember what, you would have to dig and find it. But I explained this before a long time ago, and I probably had a, a better analogy then. But let me try to explain this the best that I can. Okay. Um, When you play Call of Duty, and you play ranked mode in Call of Duty, it, there, there, there's bronze, silver, and gold, typically, right? And within these tiers, you could be on... It's leaderboards, right? You could be the 50th ranked uh, silver player, or you could be the number one ranked silver player about to get into that gold tier. But regardless, there's tiers, and then within those tiers, there's a hierarchy. Self-improvement is like moving up within that hierarchy, right? But the tiers, that's something that you got to be born with. Unless you already right here. Like, if you already at the top of the hierarchy for silvers, self-improvement going to push you to the gold. If you at the bottom of the hierarchy for silvers, you got to self-improve just to keep up with the Joneses and the silvers. Otherwise, you might just drop to bronze if you let go yourself. Does that make sense to y'all? Let me know if that made sense. But I'm being honest, bro. This stuff is, 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 is it's real, bro. You know what I'm saying? And we got to be honest with yourself. Like, look, bro. I know I'm... Listen. I'm an attractive dude, but I'm no, I know I'm 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 no ten out of ten. Let's be honest. I know that. I know I have a ceiling, but I know for a fact that like, you know, it's not about the ceiling. It's not about oh how high can I go right? Because I'm in a successful relationship. I've been in a relationship for four plus years. You know what I'm saying? And what does that mean? What am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that it's not a it's not like oh I'm gonna stop trying because I don't look good. It's more, it's more so that, it's more so that, oh, I'm finna, I'm finna do what I can because that's all I can really do. I'm gonna try my hardest to get in the gym and, and grind and whatever. And lo and behold, I managed to pull a, a girl that, you know what I'm saying? She, you know what I'm saying? She up here. You know, so I'm not saying don't try because you can always pull a girl that look better than you. But what I am saying is that on average, you won't get that. Does that make sense? They must have amnesia. They forgot that I'm him. I'm still in that meme. Hello. How old are you? I'm guess. My guess age. I'm almost 19. Your birthday? July 10th, 2005. Leo? Really, nigga? I'm a cancer. 2005, bro. Uh, that's I like... Don't. Bro, you barely older than my brother. Golly. I'm not getting old. Okay, well, believe the fucking stupid ass astrology. Shut your bitch ass up! What the fuck? I'll play with you, nigga. You got so much makeup on. That's facts. How many girls can have makeup like this? Luckily without it. Mercy, but even I thank you. Who you that? Um, everyone that's seen me without makeup. You want the only niggas that want to fuck you? No. Yeah. Anything else you want? Y'all see what he gets to get away with? Ugly. Now listen, bro. Ugly dudes or dudes under an eight are not getting away with being able to say this. This man is talking crazy. He's talking spicy. If he was anything under an eight, no diddy. Again, no diddy, bro. We're just being honest on his channel now. We just keep it at a bean. No dids. All right? No dids. No diddler. If he was anything under an eight, dog, he's not getting away with saying that, bro. I'm sorry. 
You can't talk to girls. Look, yeah. look. Want to see me without makeup? Am I the only niggas that want to fuck you? No. Yeah. Look, she no. If you under a eight, under a seven, she. Oh, what you talking about? She gonna hang up, bro. She gonna. I'm. I'm being honest, bro. It's not equal treatment. It's not. It's not. This is not the average. You're leaving me. But you want some dick? Oh, uh, you want me to say? But we were like dating now. No. Talking about dating on the monkey app. On the monkey app. Do y'all now? This is the first video I wanted to show y'all. And if y'all want me to finish reacting to this, then I, I really can. We could just break down the overall game that he's been. Cause he listen, no lie, he is spitting some actual game for real. Like verbally, the mouthpiece is there. So we gonna go over that in another video. But I want to show y'all the brutal and harsh reality. Of what it's really like for, 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 for fools out here, for you rap scallions out here, the average looking guy, right? Okay, now we at the average looking dude, all right? Now we got XQC, he's a streamer or, or something, right? Average looking guy, not super, you know, whatever. Now, obviously, like, like we, we, let me show you, this is what it's really like in IRL. This is what it's like for you. And you can always self-improve, but I just want to show y'all the difference and why looks matter so much. Looks are supreme in dating. Not the only thing, but the probably the most important. At least at the very beginning. Personality and compatibility come in relationships later on down the line. But for those of y'all, look, look, 63% of young men are single. So at least 63% of y'all need to watch this. Ignoring them. Not even giving him the time of day. Look at the way she looking at him. Look at the way. Go back in the video and look at the way the other girl was looking at old boy. And look at and, and look at this now. Look at the difference. She huh huh. Oh hell nah. What the fuck? That's it like last time. I think I added too much. Oh no, it's perfect. Yo, what's up? What are you guys doing, Arta? Huh? Oh, are you guys doing Barely Arta even looking at him, huh? Live. Fine. Thought she was about to hang up. Do y'all see the difference? I need to add more color now. Me too. Yo, can I see what you guys are working on? Like the final product? Do you have like yeah. Yeah. an example? Yeah. Yeah. Can I see? Yeah. Look, show him, kick it out. Oh, oh that's kind of cool. What is that, like slime? Yes. Yeah. What happens if you eat it? Can you eat it or not? No. Not if it's not edible. It has like glue in it and contact solution and shit. See, they talking about glue and, 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 and all this other pointless bull. You know what I'm saying? I don't even want to watch this conversation. It's boring. It's boring. Dangerous. Okay, I'm just going to do some fucking crack instead. What did you say? Sup, 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 shawty? Sorry, my bad. Sorry, my bad, sorry. It's... She ain't even react to it. You see what the difference is? And this is why it looks matter, bro. This is why it looks matter. And I'm not going to keep hounding that point. Because also, we have to recognize that XQC doesn't have the best mouthpiece. But. Old habits. He doesn't care about me. Wait, who doesn't care about you? What do you think? Your ex? No. Me? No. Um. Oh, the guy you want to be with. Huh? Something like that. You see the difference? Even on the monkey app. Even on the monkey app. It doesn't matter. Even on the monkey app. Girls will still vent to the nice guy about, you know, the guy that they really want to be with. Do you see what I'm like saying here? Girls will always treat the guy that they don't really want to be with, but he's a nice backup option like this. And it even manifests within the 30 second conversation. But this is actually a reality for a lot of you who are in the friend zone or whatever the case may be. You get vented to about the guy she really want to be with. And... You know, when you're in these situations, what you want to do is, uh, if you're interested in this girl, I would re I would recommend not being friends with her, because you're not actually friends with her in the first place. 
you was only friends with her because you wanted to go crazy and do your thing. But now that's out the picture. Why stick around and continue to be disrespectful? See, this is the this is the part that this is the part where I come in, right? This is the part where I help. Cause a lot of you are in the position of XQC right now where you get vented to about dudes that don't want her, but she want him. And the problem is that too many of you stick around. Like, let's see how long you stick around, bro. Why not? Tell me about it. And that's exactly what you do. Tell me about it. And then she start venting, and then you think you could be there and have... This is not the movies. This is not the notebook. Okay? It doesn't work like that. No, he just... Don't text me no more. Oh. You think he's got another girl? Yeah. And how does it make you feel? I'm just about to get to this bag, you know? Cause I Do y'all see the difference, bro? Do y'all see the difference? I don't even want to look. This is just painful, bro. This is, this is painful. As you see, I don't know what you on, bro. Like, you... <sighs> girls are yawning in your face. Why, why are you yawning? Are you tired? No, not really. Wait, wait. I, I have to ask, but it's 7 p.m., but it's all dark in your room. Do you have, like, blackout curtains or whatever? It's 6.42. And I live in New York, and the sun didn't set back yet, or the time, the fucking, what's that called? Daylight savings? That mm -hmm. shit didn't set back yet. So, it's still getting dark pretty early out here. See about that? That's, I'm East Coast, but I got light. What happened, what happened in New York? Did you guys lose your son or something? We have our son there. Oh, okay, okay, my bad. Sorry, because it's really dark behind you. Yeah. Right, that's kind of cool. So, what are you doing on this app anyway? I'm bored. Okay. Why do I feel like people could speak? Is it is it an A and B conversation or am I being watched by a whole bunch of people? Dang, I ain't glad she sniffed it out. But yeah, bro. But anyway, dog. This video hopefully woke some of y'all up, bro. In the future, I'm not gonna talk so much about how looks are important, but I wanted to just really get that out of the way. You know, we obviously gonna be breaking down the mouthpiece and all that stuff on this channel, but I just wanted to show you. The difference between the average man's experience versus, you know, the real top 10%, top 20%. So that's all I got for y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. I love you guys. I'm out of here, man. Peace.